The last round of Formula One action was in Japan. It was a home race for Honda, engine suppliers to Aston Martin Red Bull Racing. Ahead of the race, Dutch ace Max Verstappen was given a very special opportunity at Honda's test track, a run out in the Honda RA272. It was the very first Japanese car to win in Formula One with US racer Richie Ginter at the wheel back in 1965. Watching on as Verstappen turned laps in a historic machine was Honda's former F1 driver and Indy 500 winner Takuma Sato. I can't yeah. heel and toe because my foot. Oh, uh, okay. So I can't do uh, a... <laughs> Too tight. And then the of course idea. the steering. I'm mm. like... And then try to shift in the left hander. <laughs> it's quite tough. It's got to So I, maybe it's better I, I drive like this. Just with my arms out. <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, crazy it's how tight. It's in amazing, isn't it? I mean, can you imagine you go to the Spa Farm Go Show and then Monaco and then this wow. car? And... Next, it was Sato's turn to check out the RA272 while Verstappen switched into a modern day Red Bull. Both drivers had no doubt about the thrill of driving the 60s Grand Prix winner, complete with its 1.5 litre V12 engine. It was very cool to, to get to experience this car. I would think the, the oldest car I've driven before, a race car, has been like 2008 or something. So it's quite different, but I actually really enjoyed it. You know, also the pure emotion from the engine and also the car itself. I mean, I didn't even fit properly in the car, but uh, it, was, it was an amazing uh, experience for sure. It is a really special moment, you know, for all of the race car driver, you know, back in 60s. Such a nostalgical feeling of it. The car's obviously very different from the modern current Formula cars and race cars. And obviously Max, you know, just experiencing how different, how actually tricky and difficult to make it run smoothly. I'm really fortunate to have uh, some opportunity to run those old cars. Always make me smile. Well, I'm very happy that uh, I'm born a bit later. Um, but of course, then also grateful to be able to experience it. Well, what is it, 60 years on? <laughs> but I would not race that myself. But uh, of course, when you look in like 56 years time, the evolution um, is insane. But um, yeah, still, it's, it's good fun to go back in these cars. Formula One has moved on to Mexico for the latest round of the championship, where Verstappen has won for the past two years. He'll no doubt be inspired by his run out in the car that won the 1965 Mexican Grand Prix as he aims to complete the hat-trick at the Autodromo Hermanos Rodriguez.